All right, so Scott, uh, there's a common question that people ask. Um, it's how to make money playing video games. Yeah. Do you, do you think that that's possible? Uh, I hope so, because my son will make me millions. We've actually got some concrete answers of exactly how you could do that, so you better watch this one. All right, when I tell people that I'm a YouTube producer, uh, parents often think of their kids and say, oh, my, my kid wants to be a YouTuber. And instantly I know what type of YouTuber the kid wants to be. Do you have a guess? Yes, I do, but you tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe that you know. It, well, I know what the topic is, so it's no longer a guess. I have to oh, be honest. Oh, okay, okay. Yes, yes. I appreciate that. No, but you know what I could have instinctively said, just based on my own children's experiences, that it's almost exclusively about video games. A lot of kids see other people on YouTube that play video games and they're making a lot of money doing it, these, these handful of people. But the handful of people have really built a, a business and the, the kids don't realize how much work, how many years, oh, yeah. what, all, the, all, the, you know, all the behind the scenes stuff that it took to, to get there. And they just see it as, wow, they're playing video games that's all they do and they make a, a living at it. And so that's kind of the, the dream. It's like when we were kids, I saw kind of like my dream was NBA to be a basketball player. Wow. And I would see, you know, it was like my kind of fantasy aspiration for a career. Definitely. I, uh, <laughs> no, I, I, I could put no. you down. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, listen. <laughs> okay. I mean, I, Anyway, I won't go there. You get it. I got you. Yeah, but you uh, played NBA Jam or something on the No, Nintendo just, uh, you know, I I, wa I loved watching the Utah Jazz, and I, you know, as a kid, I, I saw them, kind of admired them. They were my heroes, and right. it's like, ooh, I want to be a basketball player, and I'm going to make millions of dollars. Yeah. Well, maybe kids see that today, but oh, for sure. more that I hear is, is YouTubers playing video games. That's what they want to do. Yeah, ask any kid, what do you want to be when you grow up? And they say, I want to be a video game programmer, a coder. But, you know, that was even just a couple of years ago. Now it's, mm -hmm. oh, no, no, I just want to play them for money. Mm -hmm. You know, be in tournaments or whatever. But literally, on, I'm st you need to explain this because people are making money playing okay. games, right? I mean... So let's say that you are a kid or an adult that wants to make a living playing video games. I'm going to give you the formula and show you how that you would actually do that. Not because I have experience but be in video game right. making money, but I do make a good living on YouTube. And I, I associate with a lot of other people that make great livings on YouTube, many of which are gamers okay, and are making a living. So I've got a list of things here. One is understand that you have a huge amount of competition. So just like me wanting to be an NBA player, I've got to compete against a whole lot of people that also have that same dream and are working really hard. That's right. So for me to be, actually make it to the NBA, you know, the same thing. You, if you want to make a living as a gamer on YouTube, the competition's fierce. Lots of, lots of competition. Because it does sound like the greatest thing ever. I get to yeah. play games and they pay me? Yeah. yeah. So how would you beat your competition? Well, you've got to create more content than the other people that are creating gaming videos. You've got to create better content. Now, hmm. what does better mean? I mean, better can mean I am the best playing this video game. I, I play the game better than anybody else. It's got to, you've got to entertain. You've got to somehow create oh, yeah. videos that YouTube, the YouTube programming algorithm thinks is better. So if somebody comes and watches your video, if they think, oh, why am I watching this guy? I'm gonna go watch you know, whoever. YouTube algorithm is going to say, oh, this isn't a very good video. We're not going to send any more traffic to it. So you've really got to make good videos that are better than, I guess, your competition. And on top of that, I imagine, too, just, you know, you have to make sure you're selecting a game that's of interest to people. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, you can't just play. Well, I guess they do play almost everything. It's, you it's, could it. probably find your niche, but. But you're right. The entertainment factor is huge because although I've never really watched them very long, I just mm -hmm. see him over my kid's shoulder or he'll have them on his phone while he's doing his homework or whatever. <laughs> That's you know, crazy. but I mean, it's like uh, the the voices, the people that are doing it. It's slick, you know. It's well written. A lot of the times, some of them aren't just off their off the cuff. So, you know do you I mean? think with my totally outgoing personality that I could make it as a gamer YouTuber? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't I think, know. I'd be like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so I, I have some suggestions for you to study successes and failures. And now I'm not talking about like. Pie success because 
Do you know, have you heard that yes, guy? Yes, yeah, oh yes, we've talked about it. He, he's one of the gamer YouTubers. He's like the most successful. But you know what? Don't compare yourself to him because he started a decade, over a decade ago. Yeah. So when I say study examples of success, see if you can find, and I've got a resource for you, see if you can find somebody that started as a gaming YouTuber a year ago or maybe two years ago or less and that's now successful. Hmm. And if, if you can find somebody that's done that, and you can study what they did and what they're doing now, then duplicate that. Then that gives you a formula that you can follow. And then I'll also suggest, and this is gonna be real easy to find, find examples of gamers that have started in the last year or two that are not doing well on YouTube and just look at their channels and see what they're doing. <laughs> and you know that you've gotta do more than that. I mean, I, I could easily say don't do what they're doing, but maybe they're doing some of the right things, they're just missing some ingredients and kind of compare and see what's missing. So the resource, Go to channelcrawler.com um, and what you can do is you can type in criteria of I'm looking for channels that have between 1,000 subscribers and whatever, you know, 100,000 or 20,000. You can put in a lot of different criteria. You can put in gaming or maybe you could put in Minecraft. I don't know. Is that a game that people... Anyway, probably um, you put in whatever search criteria you want and it will think and think and think for a few minutes and then it will come up with a list of a whole bunch of YouTube channels within those parameters. Really? Because otherwise it's hard to find and discover, especially bad yeah. performing channels, it's hard to discover them. But channel we'll find Crawler. Them all. Yeah, channel Channelcrawler.com. Crawler. Oh, that's cool. So it's a pretty handy tool. I've yeah. used it to find, find channels to collaborate with and stuff like that. Okay, another piece of advice. Let's see, we're going on seven minutes, so we're going to speed this one up. We're going we're gonna to make this content faster for you guys. Be okay with making zero dollars in your first year. Now that, that's a serious recommendation. I made zero dollars from YouTube in my first year and I'm doing very well now. Many of the YouTubers that I know that make millions of dollars a year made zero in their first year. So mm -hmm. just, just expect that. Be Plan patient. That. Yeah. Okay. This next point, I'm going to, I'm going to abridge and kind of go through it really quick because I really think that you should study entrepreneurship. The, you can make money from YouTube ads meaning YouTube will pay. And we've, we've had a lot of videos that talked about that. YouTube will pay you because advertisers pay them. Right, right? AdSense, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But if you're making this much money on AdSense, if you have a business and you're selling your own product or service, you can make this much money, like 10 or 20 times this amount right? just by knowing how to run a business. So my quick tips is study entrepreneurship. And I love, one of the ways I love learning is by audiobook. I saw you... No, you, okay. you always make fun of me when I say audiobooks because well, no, 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 he likes good. to read a... Well, yeah, but you're, you're busy. You have other things going on, so you're listening to them at the same time. Yeah, I, I did, have the luxury of being able to... I did get a hardback book to... the other day. Yeah, you, you got just time Yeah, I've got all kinds of time. He doesn't do much. I work two days a month. I do these and then some other stuff. Audiobooks or books <laughs> that I recommend. Rich Dad, Poor Dad, Cash Flow Quadrant. Those two books are by Robert Kiyosaki. They caused a huge paradigm shift, helping me understand the difference between being self-employed and a business owner. If you don't know the difference, these books will change your whole world there. Okay, another book, The E-Myth Revisited. Have you read that one? No, I have not. Okay, E stands for entrepreneur. Ah. Huge, huge paradigm shift causing book about how you can systematize your business, how you're just not working in your business as the employee, as, as the worker, but you're actually working on your business, building systems mm. that run and creating an experience. It's it's phenomenal. Okay, the four hour work week you probably listened to or read? No. No. Tim Ferriss. Okay, I, I'm giving the advice to you I don't read too. business books, generally speaking. <laughs> well, no, that's why I'm here. I'm here. Okay, I've learn. listened to hundreds of them and I've narrowed it down to like the one, that. two, three, four, or You've one, got two, four three, there. five. Yeah. Four. Well, there. that's another one. How to shoot videos that don't suck. Yeah, how to shoot video, video that, that doesn't, doesn't suck. suck. Get your verb agreement right. So I'm actually later, uh, we're going to, he, uh, Scott and I, we're going to make another video that summarizes the principles of that oh, book, cool. okay. how to shoot videos that, that, a video that doesn't suck. So <laughs> look for that video. It's actually really good, but I highly recommend the book. Who's it by? Uh, you'll find it. You'll find it. It's a, it's a great book. Um, for our work week was Tim Ferriss, huge paradigm shifts there. All right. So, um, you also should attend YouTuber conferences. Like by the time you watch this video, uh, Vid Summit, which is next week for ah. me now, um, is going to be behind by the time you watch this video. So next year, 2019, make sure you go to Vid Summit in Los Angeles. There's another one, usually around August in Dallas, called Video Marketing World. You got to go to those events if you really want to become a YouTuber. You want to build a business and succeed and make money in YouTube. That's cool. Highly recommend it. Recommend it for you too. In fact, you should come next week. Highly recommend it. I'm actually doing a breakout session. Oh, I'll talking be, about... I'll be the one who comes to yours. 
Well, <laughs> oh, I've got, so in the morning, on Friday morning, there's three breakout sessions, and you look at the topics of the other two, and I'm like, I'm so, so glad I love I'm paired up. Yeah, I'm yeah. so glad when I'm paired up with those two, because I'm yeah. going to get the bulk of the card right. on that one. I know the feeling. I'm, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> this last point I'm going to summarize, because we've also talked about it in other videos, and this is that learn that there are different ways to make money on YouTube playing video games. Okay, we, we mentioned AdSense, the advertising revenue. We could categorize, you know, having your own business, being an entrepreneur, but there's also sponsorships. So I think, I, I don't know what would relate. Oh, okay, a gaming company. What's the name? Sega. Okay, Sega. Let's say... I don't know, Sega's still around. <laughs> Nintendo. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, you play Nintendo games. <laughs> totally. what, if, what if Nintendo paid you $10,000 to, to kind of talk about and review a brand new game of theirs. I'd take okay, it. That would be a sponsor. Yeah. That happens all the time on YouTube. People get paid for sponsorships. Affiliate links is, is kind of similar, but if if I recommended, you can't see this mic, but if I said, you need to buy this, this Zoom H2N mic, uh, then click on this Amazon link and go and buy it. If you bought it from Amazon, Amazon would say, ooh, Nate recommended me, and so I'd and get, like, get some money like a dollar or yeah, something. A little commission, yeah. Merchandise. I could sell cool Be The Hero shirts. And you could sell cool, you yeah. know, Scott the Gamer Whatever. t-shirts or, or Zelda, you know, sweatbands. Yeah. Something like that. I, I started smiling because there's there's a channel that I follow um, that's a sailing channel and they sell like beer cooler mug things with their logo on it. Like hey, whatever. Whatever but, works, man. Um, and then there's there's fan funding. This is actually really big in gaming. I don't really understand it in the gaming world. And I don't understand Twitch. Twitch is another platform that I guess you post videos on. Um, like YouTube, but fans can just, when they're watching, if you do something cool, they can donate money to you while you're playing. And it happens all oh, the time. Oh, really? People... So you're literally getting coins as you play instead yeah. of just the little... I don't really understand that, but that's uh, that's how you can... Uh, what's the title? Make money playing video games <laughs> Yeah, make money on playing YouTube. video games. So hopefully you found this video helpful. If you watched this far, you definitely need to subscribe and uh, check out some of the other videos we mentioned. We'll see you tomorrow.